Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about how to enable the new taskbar thumbnails in Windows 11 26052 and also the new Copilot AI animations also from the taskbar because I saw that a lot of you guys wanted me to make a video in which I show you how to enable these features. Well, it is pretty simple. In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to do that. If you enjoy videos like these, of course, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. Of course, for this to work you have to be on the latest build from the dev or the canary channel here as i've said i'm on the build 26052 inside the canary channel for this video but this is also working for the dev channel so if you're up to date and you are on this build all you need to do now is to set up vive tool vive tool is basically a tool that helps you enable certain hidden features or features that are slowly rolling out from microsoft because they are present in the operating system but they are basically disabled for some users so we're going to have vive tool in the article below in the video description if you want to get it and just get the latest version .zip. You can open it up using File Explorer because right now with File Explorer, of course, you can extract zip archives, click on extract all, and then click on browse and make sure to extract it into a specific folder, maybe in local disk C. I've made a dedicated folder, which is called hidden features. You can do something like this, of course, but make sure to save this location because we're going to need it when we're going to run the Vive tool command. I'm going to select the folder, click on extract. I'm going to have to replace the files because I already extracted it before and we are good to go. This is all we need to do to set a Vive tool. Now we're going to have to open up the CMD as administrator. So just type in the search box CMD, right click on CMD and then click on run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. Now inside CMD, type in CD and then control V to paste the location where we extracted Vive tool. Press enter. Now we're in that location. And here we're going to have to type in the first command that will enable the new taskbar thumbnails. Vive tool slash enable slash ID 2953275. Press enter and you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. These commands and IDs were discovered by Phantomotion3 on Twitter. We're going to have his Twitter link in the pinned comment below. Make sure to follow him because he always discovers these hidden features. Now for the new Copilot animations, we have three different variants. As I've said also in the dedicated video in which I showed you the full build that was released on, you have three different variants, as I've said. A variant that will have those new animations with the pencil and also the photo. A variant that will only have a badge, basically like a notification. And also another variant that has no animation. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the new animations of course but you can also easily use the other variants so let me explain the next command is vive tool slash enable slash id 455-967-42 and then slash variant and we're going to use the variant 3 which is the new animations if you want to get only the badge on copilot you can use the variant 1 and if you don't want the new animations just use the variant 2 then press enter and you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration again a command and id discovered by phantom motion 3 now we can exit out from the cmd and make sure you restart your computer for the changes to take effect. After the restart, we're going to notice the new taskbar thumbnails, which I think are looking pretty good. So let me showcase them really fast. As you can see, we have these new animations, these new switching animations between certain apps or windows. And now we have more info about a certain window. For example, if you have multiple tabs open in File Explorer, it's going to say the first tab and how many more tabs are left. So for example, right now it should say home and three more tabs. In my opinion, this animation is looking pretty good. Some users don't like it. They say that it's pretty cut off. For me, it's decent, of course. Of course, it's not even officially announced by Microsoft, it's only a hidden feature, but it's looking pretty good as it is right now. And of course, Microsoft will improve it and refine it even further before releasing it to the general public. And talking about the new Copilot animations, basically whenever you're copying the text, you're going to get that new pencil animation inside the taskbar when you have Copilot set to the right side of the taskbar. And when you hover over that animation, you're going to have multiple options that can help you do certain actions with that text using Copilot. And the same goes also for images. If you copy an image, you're going to get a new animation with a photo and new options when you hover over a copilot. So basically, this is all there is to it. We're going to have all the info needed and also the commands that I've showed you in this video inside the article below so you can get them from there if you want. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.